Hi everyone, I'd like to share with you your Jumbo Distract a Match to help determine if your participants can be distracted, especially when driving. Have your participant focus in on three different activities. First of all, taking the shapes from the table, have them match the shape but not the color that's on the map. Making sure that the color is not used more than twice. Like that. And thirdly, having the activity done in 60 seconds time. When complete, ask the participant how to go. Time's up. Take a look to see how your participant performed. You'll notice that they matched about six of the eight shapes, ensuring none of the colors were repeated and also ensuring that the shape color did not match what was on the mat. Pretty good. No distractions. They did very well. This time we're going to do it again. Have the participant do the same activity for one minute. However, this time have them count down from 100 aloud for all of us to hear and see how they perform. The fatal reaction is a great tool to be used in conjunction with the jumbo distractor match. It gives that audio distraction. For setup, ensuring that you have four AA batteries, Secondly, ensuring that the headset is connected properly. And by powering on, do a volume control check to make sure that when the participant's wearing the headset, they cannot hear other sounds around them. By default, you will notice that the fatal reaction is flashing. It's in our echo mode, really creating an audio distraction. Before the participant begins, turn that off by using the fob. When the participant's ready to begin the attempt for a second time by matching the shapes with what's on the mat, when they begin, counting down from 100, turn on the echo. Time's up. Let's take a look how their second performance was with the audio distraction of the fatal reaction. As we examine a bit closer, let's see what the results are. We have five shapes covered. A closer look reveals that the same color was matched. Secondly, two colors were used when only one color was allowed. Ask the participant what they thought of the distraction or the activity. As an alternate distraction activity, refer to the user guide for additional details. One of the alternate distractions have the participant use their phone and another participant nearby call them. And as they do the activity, have your participant give directions to another place in town. Or have the participant who's watching text a message to your participant. And as they respond to that text, begin the timer and see how many shapes they can match while texting a message. Check to see if they're distracted. After your group has completed the activity, Refer to the discussion section on the back of the user's guide for additional questions.